siku moja tunafuliza hadi katika kaunti ya Mombasa ambapo chuo kikuu cha masomo anuai cha Mombasa kimefungwa na wanafunzi kuambiwa kuondoka chuo ni humo mara moja. Hii ni baada ya wanafunzi wa chuo hicho kugoma na kuzuarapsha kando na kusababisha uharibifu mkubwa wa mali. John Juma na maelezo zaidi kutoka Mombasa. Nipata shika ndio zapaka na panya kati ya polisi na wanagenzi wa chuo kikuu cha masomo Anuai Mombasa. Wanafunzi waliogoma wakifanya uharibifu mkubwa ndani ya chuo, kuziba barabara zipitazo karibu na chuo chao na hata kuteketeza malori mawili yanayomilikiwa na serikali ya kaunti ya Mombasa. Wanafunzi wanadai kuwa wasimamizi wa chuo wameongeza karo pasi ya kuwafahamisha hali ambayo imekuwa mzigo kwao hasa ikizingatiwa sharti wamalize kulipa karo ndipo waruhusiwe kufanya mitihani. When we came from home it was 3000 invoice. As we are speaking now, 5000 has been added on top of the 3000. My dear brothers, we are paying a fee of 70000. This is what then someone is adding someone is adding 8000 on top of 70000. We are saying we are not working here. Yes. What I'm saying here in ni shara ya njaba brother. We'll uh, look at uh, uh, these uh, issues which they are raising. Senate will have to guide a uh, management. Hata hivyo naibu chancela wa chuo hiki Profesa Joseph Mwatela amepinga madai hayo badala yake kulaumu wanafunzi kwa kukataa mwito wa kushiriki mazungumzo kupiga msasa maswala tete we waited there for over 45 minutes we thought that these people were not willing to come and, uh, and uh, have the dialogue then we came back to the office uh, and uh, i called uh, immediately uh, when i saw that the students have started uh, throwing stones kwa sasa wanafunzi hawana budi kufunga virago na kurudi nyumbani baada ya amri kwamba chuo kikuu hiki cha masomo anasa kufungwa we have decided to close this institution and the students uh, are, are, are requested to clear this place uh, at uh, ten, by 10 o'clock kulingana na profesa mwatela hakuna yeyote aliyejeruhiwa katika gacha hizo miongoni mwa hasara chuo kimepata ni kuteketezwa kwa sehemu ya afisi hata hivyo wapo wanafunzi waliotiwa nguvuni na polisi kwa kushiriki vurugu zilizotatiza amani na uharibifu wa mali somebody must be held to account We will develop mechanisms of how we're going to recover from the students whether through the institution constituency we are now saying that um, we will put it as a policy that any single person uh, from from any university for that matter who will wish to be uh, considered for things like bursaries who needs to have uh, some form of uh, communication from the institution that their discipline level is acceptable John Juma KTN News Mombasa